Hey guys, Heidi Easley here, and I teach women how to make money teaching paint parties. And I just wanted to work on a couple of projects. Um, this one is a K through 12 um, board with somebody's name on it, and then I'm doing all of the lettering. And then they'll actually put their kindergarten through 12th grade picture so they can hang it up in their home and then have all of those um, different you know pictures on there so I'm protecting the last name I don't want to put the last name out here on the interweb and then also I wanted to answer some questions about the giant snowman okay so we have our painting and while you know when you go on go ahead and tell me hi tell me where you're from I would love to know um, and then also, if you are in Paint Party Headquarters, please put hashtag PPHQ sister. I would love to know um, all of the Paint Party Headquarters sisters out there. So, um, so what I'm going to do here in just a second is I'm going to add some glitter to this. And then I'm going to answer any of your questions about joining the three-day challenge. Because here's the thing. By November, what was it? November 4th? By November 6th, you are going to have a ginormous... Santa, okay? And the reason why this is important is not only is it going to be fun and we're gonna do something in three days together, which is really, really cool, but also you can use this for number one, a present, number two, just to know that you can paint big, number three, you can use it to do your first guinea pig paint party. I mean, how cool is it gonna be just knowing this time next week you're going to be almost through completing this. And I've had a lot of people ask me about the Paisley Snow. Guys, we have prizes, okay? So what we're going to be, what I'm going to be looking for is there's three different ways to win a prize. And I'm going to actually ship you a box of fun stuff. Is the most creative snow. So you can actually go to Michael's and order them on Amazon, whatever you want. And make the snow different. It does not have to be snowflakes, okay? So different crazy snow, as well as I'm going to be doing the most creative scarf, okay? So I had somebody that said, well, I'm in Arizona and we, it doesn't really snow here. And I was like, well, put a palm tree or put a desert or whatever. Like you can be as creative as you want. So the snow is gonna be one prize. The second prize is gonna be the most creative scarf. So I just did a simple scarf here. And then the third prize is going to be the most creative hat, okay? And I think what people are not going to realize is how fun it is going to be to, hey, Linda, hey, Judy, and thank y'all for joining in, and how fun it is going to be to see all of the variations of these snowmen. Because yes, I'm gonna teach you this basic snowman, and yes, I'm making a tracer so that you can just print out and draw on your 24 by 36 canvas so that you have the exact shape that I have, but you will be able to freehand it. You will be able to either trace it if you want, and all of those things are totally up to you. What's going to be so exciting is as everybody starts to complete theirs to see what kind of snowmen we all come up with. Because this was just like one of the thousand ideas in my head for the snow. I was like, Paisley snow. Ooh, I could do this snow. I could do that snow. So I was just so, so excited. And um, hey, Terry, she's watching from Kentucky. Hey, Sherry. Um, hey, Misty. Hey, Jesse. Um, so yeah, go ahead and jump on and let me know if you have any questions because here's how it works. Once you sign up, oh, and this could be like maybe you sign up for this challenge, which by the way, the challenge is $10. So what you get for the $10 is you are going to be getting the instruction list, the tracer, so you can actually print the tracer and then be ready to um, have it drawn on so we can start Monday at 1 p.m. So the actual teaching of this is going to be in a private Facebook group called Paint Big Challenge. So when you go to try to join it, you need to let me know, hey, I paid with this email and there's just a couple of questions for you to ask or for you to answer. Now, some people have joined and they said, I didn't get an email yet. If that is you, the reason why is because it's probably a weird email like that 
not saying your email's weird, your email's fine, but sometimes like a Hotmail email won't go through. So it's kind of strange, it won't go through. Um, so what I want you to do is if you have, if you have signed up and you know you've signed up but you have not seen, oh Kimberly, I'm glad you caught me live, welcome. Um, Melissa is here and I think somebody else said, Stacy said, hey Stacy, Stacy in Ohio, got a break today from my new job training, glad I could catch ya. I'm so glad y'all are here and live. That's awesome. So make sure you ask me questions if you have any questions. Um, but the other cool thing is, is so you're gonna, and I just kind of finished taking a, a pick and just pulling out these. This is gonna be, again, a K through 12 board. So you can um, put kinder through 12th grade photos. I so wish I would have um, started this when Pixie was little. That would be a really great Christmas present too, by the way. Um, so yeah, so here's the thing about the Paint Big Challenge, and I'm gonna be adding some glitter to it. So let me switch this over. Actually, let me switch this just right here. See if I can get to the glitter. My art studio table, like this kind of looks clean, but if you looked over there, not clean at all. Have bulbs from the tree coming out, all kinds of crazy stuff. Um, so here's the thing with the Paint Big Challenge. Guys, you are not only going to be painting big and accomplishing something in a way shorter amount of time, but you're also going to be able to use what I teach you in that private group to book your first party. Or some of you that are already booking parties, you can like right away use it and start posting it. I'm gonna teach you a few things about posting, but it is literally, and this is one of the colors and this, the, um, it's called Craft Twinkles. It's a brush on glitter paint. It's my favorite. I used to, um, good morning, Cynthia. Hey, Janine. I used to always um, use all the different color glitter, and then I realized like this one is the best not just for me, but for the customer. So I'm just gonna show you kind of on the hat. And this is where you're going to be able to get really, really crazy and creative. So when you sign up for the $10 challenge, and again, some people are like, you know, why, why is it $10? Well, you're gonna get the supply list of exactly what I used in addition to the tracer so that you can just print and use this carbon paper to trace it out and then you're going to have three full days of me training you. So basically, you know, yes, some of y'all out there that are, you know, awesome painters, you're like, yeah, that's kind of simple. However, how much fun is it to get with a whole group of ladies and we're all painting the same thing and sharing all of these different designs and details and also talking about like using your talents to freaking pay for Christmas. Oh my gosh. <laughs> um, that's what I'm doing. So I, I booked another paint party this morning and, um, and I'm using that money to pay for Christmas. Like I already have it like, okay, this paint party is going to be money for Christmas presents. Then I don't have to stress about, you know, oh my gosh, you don't have to watch every single dime. No. I mean, if you, if you do a, a paint big challenge and you create this giant snowman, you can make it smaller for a paint party. You don't have to make it this big for the paint party. And then you could charge $35 a person, which in that workshop, I'm gonna show you how to get your first paint party booked. And then, so for 10 bucks, 10 bucks, you'll not only have a fun time painting and getting creative and crafty, but you're also gonna know how to um, book the party. And when we had Paint Party Business Live, it was, insanely crazy I'll tell you a little story oh hey Robbie thank you so much I'm glad you love watching good morning y'all good morning Lakila. good morning Dar is that Darcy and Robin good morning and um, the coolest thing at paint party business live and how many of y'all got to go we had um, a two-day business conference all about me teaching you how to make money teaching paint parties and what was so cool is I did an activity where they had to book parties, and I, I told them exactly how, right in front of me. So I said, okay, we got 20 minutes, we're all gonna book parties. And it was crazy how people were like, oh my gosh, I just got a response. Oh my gosh, I just got one that went message back. And I was so, guys, here's the thing, like, I don't teach you or show you things just like 
to show you. I mean, when I teach you things, I'm doing it in my own business. Like I'm literally doing that to book my parties. Um, I have hundreds and hundreds of women doing that to book their parties. So whenever I share something like that, and this is a $10 challenge, it's not like, you know, this huge risk. Oh my gosh, you know, I'm spending 14 grand to learn this. No, it's 10 bucks. And you can sign up using the link in the description. But it's 10 bucks and then you're gonna have kind of this fun next week, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. If you can't make it live, which I'm gonna be teaching them at 1 p.m. Central, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, next week, so you want to go ahead and sign up because automatically you're going to get an email. That email is going to give you the supply list so you'll know what to buy. And then it's going to give you the link to the private Facebook group for you to join up in where I'm going to be teaching the trainings live. Now here's the big thing you want to remember. If you don't get an email, because it, it goes automatically. So as soon as you sign up and you pay your $10, it goes automatically. And then what you want to do is um, check your email. If it didn't come straight away, that means it probably went to spam or promotions folder. So I want you to go over there, check that. It's kind of like an Easter egg hunt before the snowman. And then I want you to check that, pull it back into your regular inbox, and then I'm going to be providing a tracer into that Facebook group. So there are a couple of steps. I want to just be honest with you. You got to, you know, first pay for the class, and then once you pay for it, you got to find the email. Once you find the email, you request to join the group. Now that group is only gonna, it's a pop-up group. It's only gonna be open a few weeks. And the reason why, it will be archived, which means you'll be able to watch those trainings for an entire year. So if you're like, this is great, but next week I am swamped, um, but I still wanna paint a snowman, you will have an entire year to watch those trainings, those three trainings that I'm gonna do on Monday, November 4th, Tuesday, November 5th, and Wednesday, November 6th. So you'll have live trainings with me. In addition to everybody's gonna be posting their adorable snowman, and that's how I'm going to be giving the prizes. So I'm very, very excited about um, giving some prizes for who comes up with the most creative background, the most creative hat, and the most creative scarf. Because I just added some glitter. Let me see if y'all can see the glitter. It's a little bit, there we go. In person, the glitter really shines. Yeah, the glitter really shines in person. Okay, so I've had a lot of people ask about this Paisley stencil. Let me see, I think I have another one asking about it. Um, I'm a huge Paisley person. Are yours from a stencil or a stamp? I thought I saw some big wooden stamps back by the corner, um, oh man, let me see, oh, of the table, oh, okay, so I have some wooden stamps, but they're for my business, um, and I had a girl who does stamp making, I'll have to find the name, but she created a Paint Party Business Live stamp for me, and then she also created my Texas Art and Soul, so I can put these on the back of canvases, um, also, I can like tattoo them to myself if I want, <laughs> something like that, but the Paisley stencil was actually just something from um, the Paisley stencil was just from like Michael's. So I went to Michael's and found this, or I might've got it from Deco Art. I don't remember for sure. But here's the things I want y'all to remember as you're thinking or already joining um, the, oh, the snowman challenge is it's a $10 investment. I mean, the risk is like None, okay, 10 bucks. I mean, if you go to Starbucks, you're spending five something, and that's if you only order the coffee. So we are going to have three days, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday of next week, where I'm going to teach you the entire thing. And then this is 24 by 36, but your snowman can be any size you want, okay? So let's see, Tangela says, how big does our snowman have to be? Great question. It can be any size you want. So if you don't want to make it this big, and you only have room for a smaller place, that's totally fine. But what I want you to think about is like, okay, let me go use a coupon at Michael's, let me go get a giant canvas, because when you paint big like this, who has painted big? Let me know who's painted big on here. Say yes if you have, no, but I've been wanting to try. Let me know in the comments. Because here's the thing, once you start painting big, as you can see, I love painting big. I'm actually starting a giant mural project on Wednesday. 
and I'm drawing up designs tonight and I'm so, so excited about it. It's like, it's like one of my favorite things to do. I don't um, talk about it a lot because um, I don't teach people to get mural projects, but out of doing paint parties, I have gotten tons of mural projects because of that. When I do a mural project, I make sure to charge a great price, but it's almost like a vacation for me because I put on my music and I rock out and I just paint big. And there is something about painting big that just makes my heart happy. Anybody on here that, you know, when you paint big, you just, it's just this freedom. There's some kind of freedom in it when you paint big. So yes, you can do any size you want, but I encourage you to try to paint big. And um, let's see, Brian says, I love this challenge. I would love to, but I'm going on a cruise and won't have internet. Brian, that's okay. You'll have access to this for a year. You'll have access for a year. Um, and then we'll probably go ahead and put it in a YouTube unlisted, which means the public won't see it, but we'll probably email it out to you um, just because y'all paid for the challenge and then you'll have all of them together. Let's see, um, Erica's looking forward to painting big. And Chris says, no, but I'm excited to do it. It is so much fun. And um, Linda says, haven't painted big, but really want to try it. Laura, no, but would love to. And Jean says, 16 by 20 is as big as I've gone. Jean and everybody else, use a coupon from Michaels or go get a piece of wood from Lowe's and, and grab around a 24 by 36 and then just, just go for it. You're going to be like, oh my gosh, why haven't I done this sooner? And Noelle says, yes, just painted big for the first time. Did the fabulous snowman with lantern. I found my happy place in the process. Yes, I'm telling you. So it's so crazy because whenever, um, you know, I, I, um, you know, quote murals or whatever, you know, I have to quote a certain price because they are huge jobs. But when I'm doing it, I'm like, oh my gosh, I would almost pay them <laughs> because it's just this feeling. I mean, it's just this happy place. Um, Tangela says, I love to paint big. I just be running out of space when I'm done. Of course. Yeah. I'm kind of on top of myself. Every six months I purge, um, probably half of my, half of my staff. So it's about that time to start purging. And so usually I find like a, an art teacher or I'll post on buy, sell, trade. And then I get rid of like half my stuff because, um, if not, you know, we can't paint more. We got to have room to keep painting. Right. Um, Kimberly says, I love to paint big and little. Um, Deborah says, I paint big on my regular pieces. They are 24 or 36 by 48. Awesome. So you're already doing that. Great, great. And for those of y'all that are just joining, wondering what's going on, um, click the link in the comments, um, not the comments, in the description, and then you're going to get access and it'll tell you everything about what we're going to be doing with the painting big. Um, I'm not the best at painting, but I love to do it anyways. And in this, guys, I'm telling you, I'm giving you the tracer, which will be available in the group later today. Um, it is so, so much fun. So whether you, you just do this for practice or whether you're doing this to maybe do a guinea pig paint party, maybe you're doing this to build confidence, maybe you're doing this for the, the sisterhood of just seeing everybody else and what they're coming up with. Um, whatever reason you're, to get in the holiday spirit, you know, November 1st, we start, you know, all, I mean, I actually start Christmas about mid-October, but I love Halloween. I'm not, I'm not a person who's against Halloween. I do love Practical Magic. That's one of my favorite movies. Um, but there's something about like extending the season and just surrounding yourself by beautiful stuff. And then also looking at it and knowing like I did that, like I created that. And so, you know, I know people who have friends and family, they're huge snowmen fans and wouldn't it be so cool to be like here's this awesome snowman i painted for you for your decorations and um, rita says my special needs granddaughter laughs at my stick people so i'm gonna try oh my gosh rita she will be so happy at your snowman she's going to love it especially when you start adding glitter and um, hey shannon oh great to see you too i hope you're doing well and karen signed up for the challenge Ooh, who all has signed up for the challenge let me know in the comments if you have um, let's see, I love painting big. You really um, feel great. It's like you're a real artist. It, oh my gosh, it's so true. Because here's the thing, we all know this is a pretty simple snowman, right? And for those of you that are new, once I teach you next week, you will also agree that it is a, it is a simple snowman. 
But the fact is, is getting a little bit more creative with it and adding extra details, that's where all the fun comes in. Oh, Terry, who I love, who did this one, we always talk about, she did it in a smaller version for our Paint Party Headquarters group. By the way, Terry, everyone is loving that design, so thank you so much for sharing that. And she does a lot of two by three, so she does a lot of really small ones, and Terry, I would love for you to join the challenge and do a big one. And Tony says, I'm so excited to paint big first ever. Guys, I'm gonna have y'all painting floors and walls and cement. I'm gonna have y'all painting everywhere. And let's see, Terry says, I have a 16 by 20, but haven't used it yet. I will for this snowman. And Terry, I double dog dare you to go get a 24 by 36. Can you do it? You can do it! Get a 24 by 36. I'm telling you, I will have the tracer for you um, and I will show you exactly how to do it. Um, and then when you're painting big, you're going to be like, oh my gosh, this is pretty cool. So those of you that are trying to make it smaller, if you, if you have to, that's fine. But I challenge you, this three-day challenge, I challenge you to go all out. Do the 24 by 36 and just see what happens. And um, Trisha, we're glad you're here. And um, let's see, get so lost in the painting, it's relaxing to me. I am the same way, Brian. I get so lost when I'm doing a mural it's, it's like my mind has a mental vacation. Um, you know, I think a lot of us creative people, and let me know if you're one of these, but a lot of us creative people, we have so many ideas all the time that are rushing. I mean, literally like, oh, I could do that. Oh, I could do this. Or, oh my gosh, that painting would be great. Or let me add this to this. Um, and sometimes we just need a mental break. And not a mental breakdown, but a mental break, you know, from all the ideas. And when you can blast some red dirt country music or whatever you like or worship music or Christian music or whatever it is and then just paint big I mean it's just there's nothing better nothing better and um, let's see Inga Inga oh I always say it wrong I'm so sorry um snowman with lantern is my next tackle besides painting this gorgeous guy oh good I'm glad you're going to and um, let's see, I think I can buy this now and maybe getting my family together to paint the snowman and trade after. <gasps> what a great idea, Brian. He says, what about getting it now, which it's only $10, it's not a big risk, y'all. <laughs> getting it now, and then if he's on a cruise or you're traveling somewhere, then you'll have access to it for a year. Then getting everybody together, like me and Pixie always make ginger snap, snap cookies and we always go ice skating. Those are like our two big traditions. What if you made painting one of the traditions and then you all painted it, you could put the video on, watch me, you know, teaching you how to do it, have the tracers, everybody do different takes on the snowman and then everybody trade them. Wouldn't that be such a cool, fun little party to do? Um, oh good, we have so many people that signed up. Let's see, um, and if you wanna sign up for this, guys, the link is in the description. I'll take just a couple more questions. And Shana says, thank you, doing great. I signed up for the challenge. Have a big canvas on me in the barn. You gave me a push. Oh, I'm so glad you're gonna paint with us, Shanna. Um, I'm thrilled they love it. Yes, Terry, they love, and oh my gosh, somebody did cute little ornaments with them. Somebody else did, um, oh, they made the hat black, and then they did a different color background, and it was so adorable too. Um, so yeah, you have totally inspired us. Um, oh, Hot Springs, Arkansas. I want to go back there. At that church. Oh, my gosh. The church in Hot Springs. Um, I need to put on my calendar to go back there for Christmas because that glass church um, was so beautiful. And I heard at Christmas time, it's like all decorated. Is that true? If anybody knows that. The glass church in um, Hot Springs, Arkansas. I was really wanting to make a trip up there during the Christmas um, because of all the decorations and just so much beautifulness around there. Um, let's see, I've done one that size, but not a snowman, looks like fun. And um, pray big, paint big, expect big. <laughs> yes, Trisha, that's awesome. Hey Gretchen, my Facebook angel. Um, yes, let's see, Deborah's watching Stephanie. Um, today is my mental break day. Business is insane. <laughs> I hope business, um, Stephanie, is in a good way insane. I know for us doing um, all of our paint parties, like right now, is kind of like our 
go season. Although, I do have a special surprise for those of you that are in Paint Party headquarters. I have a special guest that sells almost 200 tickets every January. And so I've been telling all my paint party headquarters ladies, like, take a break. I hibernate in January. I don't have any parties. I just hibernate and I enjoy my time off with my family, which I'll probably do some of that still. But um, she kind of debunked that myth for me. And she said, no, I have like almost 200 tickets I sell every January. So we will be sharing that um, training with y'all in paint party headquarters. And um, Linda just signed up, wonderful. Yeah, if you are just signing up, all you have to do is click the link in the description. Real quick, let me tell you what's gonna happen. It's $10. $10, it's not a huge risk. <laughs> you spend more than that, like driving by the coffee shop. So $10, not a huge risk. What you're gonna get for that $10 is immediately you will get an email. The email, if you don't get the email immediately, what happened is that your email either went to spam or promotions folder. Go find it, it's like an Easter egg hunt before the snowman, right? Go find that, pull it to your regular email. That email is going to have your um, supply list. It's going to have you know what you're going to need. It's also going to have the link to the Facebook group, the private Facebook group where I'm going to teach you this next Monday at 1, next Tuesday at 1 p.m. Central, and next Wednesday at 1 p.m. Central. Now, if you, and there are prizes, okay? Three prizes for the most creative hat, the most creative scarf, and the most creative snow. So we are all going to be doing a ton of different things with our snowman. Now, the coolest thing about this is after you get that email, you put in your email that you signed up for, and then we're gonna approve you into the group. You can start looking around the group, you can start having some fun, I have a bunch of fun little information. And then in addition to teaching you this next week, I'm gonna help you get your first paint party booked, if you're interested in that. What's really cool, and what happens a lot, is people are like, oh, I did that? Oh my gosh, I could do that. And then they're like, well, why don't I just book one party to pay for my Christmas presents? And then they just book a party. You don't have to book 50 parties. You don't have to book 10. You could do what um, Brian was saying and you know have everybody over around Thanksgiving and then everybody paints one and then you trade. Um, anything like that, but it's going to be a lot of fun together. Just you know, doing this together and also sharing with each other. And I can't wait just to see everybody's different fun snowmen. I can't wait to see what y'all come up with. Um, let's see, oh, and Cynthia says, I can't always be live to paint. Will there be a recording as part of this purchase? Yes, so for $10, after it's all done, um, wonderful Brendan is going to take them and put them into a YouTube unlisted, which means only you have access to it, don't share it with people, and um, only the people who have paid for it has access, and then you have that access for up to a year. Let's see, and then I'll also walk you through how to um, do your first paint party. So I'm so excited to get your first paint party booked. Um, okay, yay, we have another sign up. Thank you, Chris. Um, let's see, when is the next opening to paint party headquarters? So Tony has a question. Paint party headquarters, the next opening, there may be a secret back door. So um, we are not opening officially to the public until May of 2020. But I would highly advise you to make sure you're on the wait list or you have signed up for this challenge so you are getting my emails because um, you may or may not, I'm not going to say anything else, you may or may not have a very, very short window of time to um, get in Paint Party Headquarters. Very short window of time coming up <clears throat> November 10th, <clears throat> November 10th, <clears throat> November 10th. Maybe a short window. Maybe. And you have to be on my email list. Um, is there a good place to get the large canvases? My local craft stores don't carry anything bigger than a 16 by 20. Deborah, um, if you are within an hour of Hobby Lobby or Michael's, I would just grab a cup of coffee, make an evening of it, and, and go find a place that has these bigger ones. Or just go to Lowe's and buy you one of those pieces of wood that are you know around this size. It doesn't have to be exactly this size. And those pieces of wood, usually there's some places of wood that you can just grab one and go. And need information on joining Paint Party Headquarters. So Pamela, um, after I get done with this live, 
I'll put the link for the wait list. Um, you definitely want to be on the wait list. Like I said, <clears throat> November 10th, <clears throat> November 10th, there may or may not be a very short window of time for you to get in before. <laughs> and it's only done by email. Um, okay, Kimberly says, I just bought my canvas 50% off at Hobby Lobby. Yes, I am actually going today and using a coupon to get another one so I can paint another when I'm teaching you to paint it again. And I will be teaching it live, painting it again. And um, yes, Jerry's Artorama has great um, canvases too. I love the time. I'm on vacation and can do this. Wonderful. Oh my gosh, thank you for sprinkling the love. And Erica says, I'm stuck with booking parties. Ugh, I'm looking forward to the inspiration from the group. Thank you, Heidi Easley. You are so welcome. We'll be talking a lot about that too. And of course, in Paint Party Headquarters, anytime you get stuck, make sure you're posting. Um, I'll be painting the snowman with my daughters. Oh my gosh, this is the thing about the snowman. It's more than just a snowman. It's like you get to connect. Like if you have, you know, if you're a grandma or a mom or you want to do something fun, holiday. I mean, how many times, I'm going to get sentimental here. How many times do we like rush, rush, rush through the holidays and we totally like did not create any memories? We were literally like trying to find the best wrapping paper or, you know, here's a fun thing that me and Pixie do just to make wrapping paper memorable. Like I try to like add these little things in because we are so, all, we're all so, so busy. And so we go to Walmart to get wrapping paper and I love buying wrapping paper. I mean, it's like more fun than buying the present for me. And so I go in and we like all those rolls of wrapping paper and we spend about 20 minutes so you know if you want to factor in for that we do stupid things like this but i feel like it makes memories and it's fun and we'll um say okay i'm gonna close my eyes and then you need to pick one and then i'm gonna turn around and guess which one i think she picked and so we'll do stupid things like that just to like make a trip to walmart fun because who likes to go to walmart right and so little stupid things like that are so fun but what i want you to do is to think about um, think about the, the little memories you can make through these next two months. You have two full months of fun holiday, and, and it doesn't have to be expensive. You're talking $10, $10, right? It doesn't have to be expensive. Find an old piece of wood, grab a poster board. I mean, if you can't do the canvas, which I think I bought this canvas, canvas at 70% off when they were on sale, so I probably paid under 15 bucks for a 24 by 36. But it does not have to be expensive. Do it on poster board, but creating the memories, those are the things, you know, the other day Pixie was telling me, hey, let's do the wrapping paper thing again. And I'm like, oh my gosh, I can't believe she remembered that. Um, let's see, Heather says, can watch anytime even if I pay. Yes, you can watch it anytime. Um, sprinkled the snowman love, thank you. Um, yay, yes, we have some people that went to Paint Party Business Live. Um, hey from Tex hey from the Texas, how do I find the signups for glasses? Um, oh, the sign up for this? Is that what you're talking about? Um, or for classes. Are you meaning for classes? If you are in Texas and you want to um, come to one of my classes, like my paint party classes in person, you just go to Texas Art and Soul and go to events. Um, oh, good, Tangela. I know. I want you back. <laughs> um, let's see, Kelsey says, Michael's online delivers quickly if you don't have one close. Oh, that's good to know. That's great. And the canvas is 24 by 36. 24 by 36. Jen says, I had my first party Sunday night crafting for a cure for breast cancer awareness, and it was great. Thank you, Heidi, for, let me see what she's thanking me for. Sometimes I can't see more. My fingers are too fat. Uh, I want to see what you said. Oh, there we go. Um, I'm way up close. Sorry. And um, thank you, Heidi, for pushing me out of my comfort zone and helping me go for it. And patiently waiting for Paint Party Headquarters. Jen, mark your calendar. <clears throat> November 10th. <clears throat> November 10th. It's a secret only through email. So make sure you are on my emails. Deborah, just signed up. Thank you. Looking forward to the day off. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. We have so many people that signed up. Kimberly, wonderful. Um, oh, thank you, Sherry, for watching the videos. When you paint on canvas, do you put the primer on first? No, just get you a white canvas. Guys, on wood, I don't even prime. <laughs> I just paint. I just go for it. 
Um, you can look for old paintings at a thrift store and paint over it. Very true. If you want to go to Goodwill and paint over an old painting, then you have a frame too. <gasps> you might be able to get a creative point for frames. It's a good thought. Good thought. All right, so we got Dawn already signed up. Awesome. Kelsey, um, yep, the, the thing's already primed for you. And then I'm going to answer one last question. Um, I'm headed out after for the first time to speak with a manager of a local restaurant to book my first paint party. Wonderful. That's so exciting. So, guys, for this $10, just to recap, and my fat finger won't. There we go. Um, fat finger won't do it. I don't know how to get that without paying the $10. Oh, okay. So, Trudy, post that in the group, and I just posted a post in Paint Party Headquarters about that. So make sure um, you go look in Paint Party Headquarters. I just posted something about that. Um, so in addition to, so when you pay the $10, you're going to get an email right away. The link is in the description. And then you're going to get the supply list of what you need to go buy because Monday at 1 p.m. Central, I will start the training, the, the tutorial. We'll actually start the first part of the painting. Um, what I want to remind you guys, we will be talking about how to book your face first paint party. We'll be talking about that kind of stuff. So if you're a person who's interested in that and wants a way to use this gift, you know, of doing something kind of fun and crafty to pay for your Christmas, then please, please, please don't miss this. Okay, so don't miss this challenge because um, right now, I mean, this is when all of the parties are happening. This is the, the easiest time of the year to book parties. So I really want y'all to um, have that opportunity. So if you want to join us, it's $10. You literally spend more driving by Starbucks, like spend more money by driving by. So make sure you click on the link in the description. And then there's also going to be um, something emailed to you right away. So if you don't see it, go search in your, in your spam folder or in your promotions folder and pull it out. And it's gonna give you the next steps, the next directions. If you signed up and you did not get an email, make sure you message us so that somebody can help you get that email. All right, guys, I hope y'all have a wonderful day and I can't wait to do this with you next week. It's so, so, so much fun. I can't wait to see. And again, three prizes for the most creative background, most creative hat, and most creative scarf. So I will be mailing three prizes for that too. So sign up today. The link is in the description and I'll see y'all next time. Bye guys. Mm -hmm.